For music's biggest night, a local student will be getting her big break. She's been selected as one of only two high school teenagers to officially cover the Grammys. CBS News' Vince Girasoli is visiting with her at Geneva High School this morning. Hi, Vince. You know, I have a smile on my face, Erin, but I wonder if I should be a little bit worried, too, because all the students here at Geneva High School in their media arts department, they seem to be able to do our jobs, and in, in some cases, better than we do them. Like Angelie Humbert, for example, you do a much better job at covering the music scene than I no. do. <laughs> all right, so she was selected to be one of only two teenagers by the Grammys to cover the Grammys. You're leaving when, and what will you be doing when you go out there? I will be leaving on Friday, and right when I arrive, I will be doing eight-hour days, essentially, of covering jazz campers who are are through the Grammy Foundation and also covering red carpets of the events leading up to the Grammys televised edition and then at the red carpet itself. Are you nervous about meeting some of the big artists? You know, it's easy to be a little intimidated by some of those names, but... I don't think you're going to be intimidated. I've seen your poise this morning. It's fantastic. Thank okay, you. your pick for record of the year. The nominees are Fancy by Iggy Azalea, Chandelier by Sia, mm -hmm. Stay With Me, Sam Smith, Shake It Off by Taylor Swift and All About That Bass, Megan Trainer. And your choice is? Shake It Off by Taylor Swift. Okay, why so? I think that Taylor Swift has this incredible ability to constantly reinvent herself while still kind of being true to who she is. And Shake It Off is just, it's the anthem to that. And she portrays it perfectly. I wonder if Entertainment Tonight's listening because she's really doing a good job. Uh, teachers have influenced you. Tell me a little bit about the teachers who influenced you. It started in second grade with um, a teacher who kind of taught me that it was cool to like to read and write, Miss Bensini. And she started it off, and ever since then, I've had an incredible collection of teachers throughout middle school and high school. Um, Mrs. Hepker, Mr. Santo, Mr. Whitman, Mrs. Peters, Mr. Burns, all these people have sort of shaped me to tell me that it's okay to love what I like to do. Job well done to them. Job well done by you. There's Mr. Santo over there. Big round of applause and a big round of applause for all the students here at GTV. Best of luck to you as you head on out to the Grammys, Angelie. And uh, stay in touch with us. Uh, give us some uh, updates when you're out there in Los I Angeles. Will. Hey, it is cool to read and write. Amen. Cheers. We've all had Good teachers luck. that have impacted us, right? Yes.